Hey guys, and welcome to another video of 365. Alright, so today I am going to get started on Allie's room redo. Ah, did I break my room? You sure can, but I think what we're going to do is paint the whole thing blue as well as this hey, blue. and this. And attempting hey, that little you're table right there. Like and then what we'll do is we will whitewash on top of the blue. And that way all the pieces in this room will match. Actually, probably the headboard too. And that way everything will match. So nothing in this room is going to be super childish. Everything's going to just look nice and neutral. Ryan is scraping the vanity right now. And I'm actually going to start painting some of the other wood pieces in the room. I'm going to do the blanket rack. And then I'm going to work on the headboard and the dresser. And we are going to be doing all of these with a porcelain finish, chalk paint, whitewash, with some blue accents. I'm going to get started on painting the blanket rack and then we're going to start putting this whole room together. Next up on the to be painted list is Allie's headboard and this little table. I don't know if this little table is going to take paint very well, but we will see. That was a fail. I didn't take the color anywhere near as well as the unfinished wood did. Now, the instructions on the paint can said that you don't actually have to remove the finish in order for this to be successful, but as you can see, it barely took any of that blue. Nowhere near as well as the drawers did. So if I want that to work, I think I'm gonna have to buff off some of that finish, which I was not planning on doing. All right, so there is Allie's dresser. Emptied everything out. We're going to take the stickers off. We'll sand it down and we will uh, white and blue wash it to match the other pieces. I think two drawers sanded. One more to go. And those stickers took some real sand on to get the glue off. So this used to be last Leslie's and we've got some teenager writing right here. Drawers are done. Dresser is done. We vacuumed off all the dust. We're ready to start painting. The dresser is going to get the same treatment as the vanity. We're going to get a blue wash on here, a white wash on the sides and on the edges. The drawers are all going to get blue, and I think I'm going to do a white stencil on the top of this one. And I'm going to do white on the inset decorative bits of this drawer. crappy little an Ikea table um, so it's not real wood I buffed it with the sander to try to give it a, a rough edge to stick to if it works awesome if it doesn't I don't care it looks like garbage that's okay because it looked like garbage before and now it looks like garbage that matches the other stuff in her room it's staying in there anyway, so at least it's matching garbage. All right, headboard is done. White washed, blue washed, and detailed with white. So we gotta let it dry, and then we'll seal it, and hopefully we assemble the room tomorrow. Okay, so today is the day that we take everything we have done for Allie's room, and we bring it all together. So I'm gonna take you into the room of yellow. So, the. All right, so here it is. This is it. We are going to take this before of a room and turn it into an after. All right, so here we go. All right, this is Allie's absolute disaster of a room. Um, pulling out the dresser, pulling out all of her toy storage. Uh, we just kind of shoved everything at the end of the room until we could get everything sorted. So that's why it's such a mess. But yeah, this is this is it. So goodbye, old room. And hello to Welcome to Change. Okay then. Right. <laughs> Don't get in my way. <laughs> oh, her room is a pigsty. 
I feel like I just did a really thorough clean job on it too, like within the last yeah, few weeks. You do that on any of the kids' bedrooms, and it only lasts a little over a week before it turns into complete chaos again. Yeah. So yeah, we're just plugging along, getting all this stuff out of the room. Oh. It, it, this desperately needed to be done. Being my good helper. This bin is heavy. <laughs> Thank you. So since all of uh, Ali's clothing is out of her dresser, I thought I'd take this as a really good opportunity to go through her stuff and get rid of the stuff that's way too small for her or that she just doesn't ever wear. There's a lot of stuff that I just never put her in and might as well donate it. So let's get to doing this. Thank you for all your help, baby. You've been really helpful today. I honestly think she's only doing it because she thinks she'll get a treat if she's helpful. <laughs> yeah. We are cleaning it up and changing the layout. Your bed's going to be over here with the new headboard. Yep, you'll see. We'll show you when it's done. Alright, so our first piece of furniture is going into the room. Alright, so we took a short break for some lunch and now we are actually about to get started on the decorating, the actual fun part of this uh, bedroom makeover. So I have done the not fun part. I've got all of Allie's clothes sorted into her drawers, ready to go. Now this big old pile here that uh, I've already posted an ad for online so somebody can come and pick that up. And we've got all of this stuff ready to go to decorate. Alright, so all the big pieces of furniture are in the room. What do you think? It looks good. I think it looks fantastic. The blue looks really nice in here. It actually tones down the yellow quite a bit, I think. Yeah, I really like the way all these colors work together. So we still have uh, things to go up on the wall. Shelving and pictures and decorative stuff and bins to fill with toys. So we gotta keep going.
Okay, and her room is finished. All the finishing touches have been put in place, and now let me show you the before and after. All that's left is to show Allie her made-over bedroom. Right. All right, take a look. <laughs> what do you think, baby? Look at your animal books up there. They look so cute up there, Mommy. If you like my bedroom makeover, give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. And subscribe to our channel. We'll see you next time, guys.